this is really cool to have everybody in the same room to kick this thing off. Kind of fires me up, man. That's awesome. Jed, take it away. Awesome. Thanks, Counts. Yeah, he talked about just how cool it is to be in a, in a big new clubhouse. And yeah, I've done this for a long time as well. And I, and I feel the same way that, you know, it never gets old. You guys are the talent. You guys are why we're all here. It does matter that you're a club. I mean, it's, it's a special place. It's a privilege. It's an honor. It's, it's, it's an amazing thing that all of us get to be associated with something that means so much to so many people. Just um, treat it with respect. It's going to be an awesome season. We should win this division. But everybody's got to work really hard to get there. And I hope you guys are ready for it. So that's it. Just to finish, uh, players, we'll take care of you on the schedule today. We've, we're taking over the whole complex today with lives going on and everything. So coaches will help you at stretch, know where you want to be. Ask a coach if you don't know. Let's have a great day. All right. Going to work at Wrigley is always just something that's been appealing. Just walking into the park, even in the winter, very few places in like sports stadiums and arenas, like there's energy even though there's not a game going on. That's how I feel about walking into Wrigley. And then look at this bar right here in the corner. Like, right there. The Cubby Bear, like that's a famous place. And then mom's mom's first apartment was like down this street, like five blocks down the street and left. That was her first apartment. My wife, Michelle, was a teacher in Chicago. She actually took me to my first game at Wrigley. I was playing in the minor leagues. I had broken my leg, I was on crutches. She wanted to go to a game at Wrigley with her friends. I wasn't too happy with her, to be honest with you, because I was like walking up the grandstand in crutches to the back row. <laughs> but you see the bleachers, it's a park. That makes you feel like a kid. And it just feels like, man, this is the way it should be. This is the way it should be everywhere. Good. Yeah. I'm gonna get the first five minutes over with, and then I'm fine. Yeah, let's 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 do it. Yeah. When you're starting out new somewhere, you have to trust your instincts. You have to trust the people around you and the organization around you, and that trust often leads to people going in the right direction. You walk into, you know, Wrigley today. You walk into a place that, like, you already know it demands your best. That is the challenge I have ahead of me. It's a big one, it takes time, um, but it's the one that I have to get right. We couldn't think of a more impactful decision than making sure that we had the best leader that we could possibly find in Craig Council. If we put the two play on, it's always gonna be a, for a, a reliever. It's gonna be late in the game, extra innings, right? So it's relievers really that have to, to me, have to understand the two play. Baseman, hard bunch to you, man. He better be there. His job to be there. It's been really fun to have somebody that is as diligent as him, as assertive as him, but also as caring as him. I can't wait to work with him for more than the next five years. Stage, I'd like to introduce Cubs President of Baseball Operations, Jed Hoyer. We have new Cubs pitcher, Shota Imanaga. Hey, Chicago. <laughs> what do you say? Cubs going to win today.
やはりこのチームを決める際にやはり自分と一緒に、えー、強くなっていくチーム自分と一緒に成長していくチーム、うん、それが一番僕にフィットするかと思ったので。こんな、えー、選手でもあんなたくさんの、ね、声援をもらったのでまだこうメジャーでいく、はい、これは、えー、本当に皆さんに感謝してリスペクトを持って野球に取り組む必要があるなと感じました。去年 WBC で、えっと、決勝のピッチャーだったアメリカ戦で決勝のピッチャーだったので,で実際に見てみたいと思ってきました。ね、でもかわいいかわいい。For us is he's cute. <laughs> to watch someone that's never really been in the States and come from an entirely different culture into the most competitive league in the world. I mean, it's just an unreal adjustment that you have to make, but he's made a great first impression so far. I'm a gentleman. I'm a gentleman. <laughs> Go, say something in Japanese. Yeah. How are you? Choshiwa, how are you? How are you? How are you? Choshiwa? Choshiwa? How are you? Choshiwa, how are you? Genki desu ka? Genki desu. Genki desu. Genki desu ka? Genki desu. Okay, Naruto Sumagi. Genki desu ka? Yeah. Naruto Sumagi. You like ramen? You like ramen? Yeah. What kind of ramen? Show you ramen for me. Show you for me. No, I like a barbecue. Ah, como se llama? Miso. Miso or tonkatsu? Miso, show you tonkatsu. No, miso. In LA, Pasadena, the last two years, there's a place called Sato Ramen House. I told Seiya, when we go this year, I take them. I take you too. Right. Good? Good. My, on me. You've learned a lot about assimilating to a new culture. That's something that Say has been able to teach us, and we've kind of been building the plane while flying it with him, and, and really excited that we can make some of those adjustments and then apply them, not only to make Say's experience better moving forward, but show his experience better here. Uh, last one, ball and glove. Yeah, on your hat. Yeah. Hi, I'm the Japanese national team. I've been there. 顔を合わせてましたし、同じリーグで何度も対戦していて。はよ。そう、へそう。thank you。ニコホーナー何歳。通りもするでしょう。見てる見てる。いやめっちゃいいてかヘンドリックスとかめっちゃいいあのキャッチボールとかやばいめっちゃ丁寧にやる日本の若手ぐらいちゃんとやってるこの時乱闘ある初年度は開幕した三戦目でいきなり乱闘え,え乱闘パターンってど,どういうパターンあのあ当て当てて当て返すかねはいチャンピオンリングを
それを達成するってことがあの今シーズンの目標ですし、えー、そうなる目標を持ってるってことがすごく自分の中では、えー、モチベーションの一つですね。Breaking overnight that Cody Bellinger is back in a Cubs uniform. This is the guy that Cubs need at the center of their lineup if they're going to compete for the NL Central. Thank you all for joining us. We have Jed Hoyer, Cody Bellinger, and Scott Morris. Hello, hello. Seeing all the reaction from your teammates, Dan's Beast talked publicly to some of the other guys. What was your reaction to seeing all of that and how good did it feel kind of to come back? Yeah, it was amazing. Everyone knew how great of a time I had last year and,、uh, you know, how just a great, great clubhouse that we had and,、um, you know, just the positive words that they were bringing was just great to hear and obviously was super excited to get back here with them. Yeah, I haven't heard from Dansby since Saturday night, so it's, it's, <laughs> it's been kind of nice. It didn't surprise me that there was so much desire to bring him back, but I, don't, I think they wanted to bring back the player and I think they wanted to bring back the person and I think that. That's wonderful. I feel like with a lot of the moves we were able to make, we've been able to create some great momentum. I think the, the balance of the veterans and the players that have just established themselves, and then the players that are coming up and trying to establish themselves, those things combined make it a really, really fun time to be a Cub. And make me really excited about what's next for us.